we just installed a radar and a uh, dash cam for this uh, Mustang GT here. My friend just got this uh, 2018 Mustang. And to save you guys uh, trouble and time, the fuse is on the passenger side and we tap it into number 23. Number 23, which is a uh, the window switch, 23, for the uh, dash cam. And then for the radar, we use number uh, 37, the heat steel one for those who are interested. And the ground would be this giant bolt up here. Yeah, the radar is on. And uh, the dash cam is on over here. Yep, just a quick video to show you guys. And this GT is me. All right, I guess we can shut off the engine now. And the fuse type, the Mustang, it used, uh, sorry, micro fuse. So it uses tiny fuse. Oh, I forgot to show you guys the close up of the adder circuit or adder fuse. This um, is not the one from the Mustang, but it's the, just to show the concept. Uh, you, when you pull your main fuse from the fuse box, you'll put it here closer to the blade. The add on fuse or the piggyback fuse will be a low uh, amp between 5 and 10. It is not good to uh, match it. Let's say you pull a 20, you don't have to put a 20 here. To say that's not good, so just put keep it five and 10, you should be fine. Um, but just want to give you, uh, point out that keep your main fuse closest to the blade and the add-on fuse away from the blade. That's all I want to point out here. The wire is running here, up here. Uh, save some slack uh, along this. Took that piece off earlier along the uh, headline all the way to uh, the A-pillar, but watch out for the air pack, so we're just gonna go right on, on top, it's sitting barely here. Open up your weather seal here, and then you can run it all the way down and close up the fuse box. This is for the radar. All right, we finished running the, uh, the cable. Just wanna show you how the cable was final. Uh, wait, this is how it was decided. The camera, the front and back, gonna go this way up the pillar, and the main power gonna come down to the pillar like this, into the glove box. Feed it up here, in the back of the glove box come down here and then the back camera up here with the pillar running along the water strip and the inside run along this uh, uh, they hit it under here up the head uh, the back liner and up there it's a wad of cable where I was able to stuff it up there but there's a hump right here by the third brake light so that's where uh, I was able to stuff all the wire up there and this is how the camera look in the back from outside, you can't see it at all. 